Good morning, good morning. Uh, it's uh, February 11th, um, day five of my trip here at Coolaway, North Carolina. Today looks like a day full of rain, uh, which means day two. Yesterday I recovered. Uh, one, because of major fatigue and uh, a great accomplishment. Uh, I climbed over 19,000 feet in three days of riding here. Um, and I feel pretty proud of myself, to be honest. I've had a, a tough last two winters of uh, near-death experiences. That's my phone you hear. Um, and I'm just overwhelmed uh, that I'm able to still ride my bike. Um, today looks like another day full of rain. Uh, I gotta look at the forecast. <clears throat> Maybe, because I think the rain is coming from, from the west. So maybe if I drive west an hour, uh, or something like that, um, I can catch or try to find myself a big hill to go do some repeats or to enjoy my cycling. Um, or if not, I'll stay here and uh, up and down Ely J. Uh, I, here I am, enjoying a great film. Yes, it's on mute because I didn't want it to uh, overwhelm me talking. Uh, so we'll see. We'll see what, what, what's on the plan today. Definitely riding the bicycle. Unless the weather doesn't permit. Yep, yep, yep. This is my daily little routine. I make myself my beautiful cup of java. Then uh, I make myself three hardball legs after having one or two bananas, depending how hungry I am. This is my abode, La Bicicleta. Um, this up a little bit. This Shram ETAP Y Fly. Let's get this dirt off of here. Gotta have that ready in case is unbelievable. Unbelievable. My serious SP Pro. Bam, ba bam, bam. This is where I do all my planning. Um, let's make ourselves outside. Here we are. The car, a little bit of wood, which I haven't used yet. Um, today looks like, uh, We'll see, I gotta wait for the rain to die out a little bit if it decides to. Um, I think I'm gonna take a drive to uh, the Nantahala National Forest, which is roughly, I don't know, 20, 30 miles from here. Um, park at the base of a climb on Waya Road. It's very, desolate, beautiful. Uh, I'll see if I can take some video. Um, it's like a six mile climb with about close to 1900 feet in six miles. So maybe I'll do it once, come back down. If I've not frozen and still have desire, go back up and do it again. Um, Let's see. Let's see how I'm. Let's see how this pans out today. But hopefully that's the plan. Um, let's see. Yeah. 
Yeah, it's coming down pretty good. Still debating whether I'm going to drive over and do this climb. My desires are strong, but I am not interested in getting sick. Because I still have another 13 days of riding. So, why would I jeopardize 13 days over today? Uh, decisions, decisions. Yep, and the rain continues. The beauty of nature. It's uh, 1.43 p.m. I decided to cancel my ride today. It's probably a wise decision. Uh, just, just cause. Preventing illness, and disaster, and God knows what. Um, I opted to uh, design a route for tomorrow. Uh, it's going to be 52 miles and 7,000 something feet. Delicious. So, uh, that's on the menu. I'm going to go for a little drive, see if I get something to eat. And uh, we'll take it from there. I found here on uh, places to eat. Uh, four and a half stars, Guadalupe Cafe. Looks like Mexican. Pictures look good. I think we're gonna give that a shot. Yup. That looks good enough for me. Yum yum, let me get some. Is I am starving. Um. All right. All right. Just arrived in uh, the town called Silva, and uh, heading to the Guadalupe Cafe. Take a look around. Nice looking place. Aha. No, that's Lulu's. Lulu is not Guadalupe. Lulu, not Guadalupe. All right, this looks like our spot. Just walked in, front door. I think this looked pretty appealing, so I opted to sit here. Whoa, this place is pretty serious. Uh, oh boy. Okra spares, fried plantain, grilled local greens, stuffed avocado, masala fries, samosas fried tofu, salsa samplers, uh, quesadilla, taco, burritos, nachos, beans and rice, uh, brunch drinks, not, uh, breakfast and lunch, huevos rancheros, veggie scrambler, organic pancakes, uh oh, breakfast burritos, shrimp and grits, ginger barbecue pork, BLT and rolls, buffalo burger, uh, brunch sides, 
This doesn't make fun. It's a lot, a lot of goodies. Made fresh to order with locally sourced happy chicken farm eggs, humanely raised, all natural meats, local produce, fabulous artisanal cheeses, and love. Whew. Man. I'm excited. I'm having an order of samosas, which is three of them, um, and some sort of uh, avocado salad or other. We'll see. They said it brought some pico de gallo that has onions, um, but I'm having them replace the onions with uh, tomato and garlic or something. So I'm thrilled. I'm starving. Yum. Got my dishes in. I'm gonna see if I uh, can do a little lighting. This is the avocado salad, and this is my samosas. I am excited. Holy moly! Take a look. That was delicious. The samosas are amazing. And uh, the avocado salad was awesome. Very kind of them to remove the onions. Uh, very good, very good. All right, we're getting a little bit out of hand here. Don't know why, but I deserve it, that's why. I'm gonna have myself supposedly an excellent coffee. Uh, kind of grown here by some awesome lady. So let's see. And dun 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 dun. Blueberry cobbler. Mm, all right, all right. I told him no ice cream. Why should I be guilty of what? I eat what I want when I want. All right, here it is. The yummy coffee. And yeah, the cobbler. Mm. Well, I will say, I'll go to the cobbler first. It is amazing and not even sweet, which makes it even more amazing because that means I can eat all of it. And the coffee is actually excellent. Something says I'm coming back here. I am full. You're wondering why? Oh. Uh, uh, uh. Where'd it go? This place is amazing. My table was amazing. <laughs>